Oh no. Okay, NASA, NASA thanks you. Okay, three bullets left. Robocop is basically a one, one man army.
Teet vast vasuuka. Ouch. Hack the turret. As you request. Hack the world. Damage inflicted. Okay, now those turrets have a green lights indicating that they are on, on my side. So, everyone stand down. What are you doing? Why did you stop? That is not what I pay you for. Turns out you don't pay us at all. What? The money transfer didn't go through. We will settle this. <laughs> no, no money, no followers. battles for you. We don't work for free. No hard feelings, Robocop. Just business. <laughs> Just business. I have bigger fish to fry. You ungrateful fucks! You closed the door on the most ambitious project in this goddamn city! Surrender, or there will be trouble. I still have an army. That will fight no matter what. So, Robocop, prepare to meet your demise. Yeah, that works. Now there is trouble. This isn't over. That's pretty badass. Stay away. Stay the hell away. Dead or alive, you are coming with me. Throw 
Lots of lots of robots. You can't win this. Not while OCP still stands. There is nowhere else to go, Wendell Antonowski. That's not even my real name. OCP gave me that identity. They knew evoking your past affects you. Well, they wanted you emotional to better manipulate you. You keep sacrificing yourself, and that's admirable. But at some point, you have to ask yourself, for what? For the city that wants to witness your downfall? He has at least 50 liters of blood. <laughs> sabotaging you. Join me. Together we can hold OCP accountable. Another empty promise. You hunt criminals down. Oh, let's make a stand against the biggest criminal of them all. It's time for you to stop obeying OCP and start putting yourself first. Locking you up is putting myself first. Oh, that would be a mistake. I am only human. The war don't die like Oh, <laughs> that was anti-climatic. Is it done? Is Wendell Antonowski... Dead. What about the city? Everyone pulled through. We've got it under control, I think. We just got here moments before you. People are exhausted and trying to catch a little sleep, but I'm sure they would prefer catching up with you. I will keep that in mind. And Murphy, good job. Good job. Oh, yeah, we, we missed her first. So it's true. He's dead? I am sorry that it did not happen in front of cameras. <laughs> That's all right. There's always another story. But tell me this. You killed the guy who started this all, exposed UEDs for what they are, and made sure they won't replace cops. You contained the riots and at least postponed the creation of Delta City. What is your question? After doing all that, why is no one celebrating? That is not why we do this. What a thankless job. Actually, maybe that's a story worth pursuing. Would yeah. Channel 9 be interested? <laughs> Funny you should say that. I'm considering jumping ship. I realize that blindly chasing a story that would nail OCP made me hurt a lot of people who didn't deserve it. Mainly you. That's nice. There's this local paper that does what I always said I wanted to do. They help people in the community and give them a voice. Oh, and it 
probably wasn't clear, but I tried to hide an I'm sorry somewhere in all this. Noted. I'm glad. See you out there, Robo. You will. Okay. Uh, seriously, man, I'm done. <laughs> Just complaining. Washington. You caught me sleeping at the desk. It's like I'm trying to convince you that I'm not cut out to be an officer. We are all tired. I talked to Reed and he said that someone from OCP already contacted him. Since the UEDs turned out to be a bust, they'll be reinstating everyone. Everyone that meets the criteria, of course. Since Becca no longer needs me, I think that's the end of my career. Will that stop you from sending in another application? What? No, never. Yeah. You can count on my recommendation, officer. You do that for me? I don't know what to say. Thank you, Robocop. It's been an honor. You help Ulysses become a competent cop. Nice. Mission successful. So, Antonowski finally got what he deserved. Damn right. No escaping the grave. I'm so tired I can't move a muscle. Oh, that's a shame. Because the guy from the Holy Cow joint he came by earlier and left a tray of burgers in the staff room as a thank you for our work. Shut your mouth! Yeah. <laughs> it is safe out there again. Oh, thank you. But I felt pretty safe ever since you left me with your partner, Officer Lewis. Feisty little thing, isn't she? She makes me feel safe, too. Usually I'm a little anxious about leaving my patients. But these past couple of days, I've gotten to meet some of the people in your world. Despite your circumstances, you've made a good life for yourself, Alex Murphy. I'm confident in saying that I'm leaving you in good hands. Thank you, Doctor. You know, I've been selected to join the Committee on Integration of Cybernetic Organisms into Society. I think it's important for people to know what I've learned here with you. I'll pass my conclusions along, and I hope OCP will do right by you. At least this one time. Goodbye, Alex. Okay. You don't look so hot. Was your neighborhood affected by the riots? I don't know. Once they begin, I was too afraid to leave this place. I locked myself in a storage locker. I get it. I'd probably do the same. This precinct really makes you feel secure. Over the course of our relationship, I've grown enough to admit that it was mostly you who took down Wendell. So, good job, Tin Man. That guy brought a lot of suffer into this city. The phone calls I got from people begging for help made my stomach turn. It was overwhelming. At first, I didn't know what to do. First time doing something selfless. And last, I'm exhausted. I don't know how you do it. I had to help myself to a little pick-me-up that I found in the property room. Um, mm -hmm. You guys confiscate a lot of good stuff. Hmm. That is not something you should say to me. Okay, he was then didn't I come clean. Not say anything anymore. My medicine is starting to kick in anyway. Later, Tin Man. Uh, I suppose it was possible t for him to Robo. Lewis was come clean. She's in the locker room. Okay, Lewis. Okay. That you, partner? What's up? You're back. So it's done. It is. 
Did Wendell do one of his kill him speeches after which he always leaves? Yeah. He did. What a cheese ball. So, are you gonna stand around like that the whole day? Come on, sit down. A lot of things have changed since I wasn't around. For one, I've heard that there's another woman in your life. Another woman? Dr. Blanche, seems that you two spent a lot of time talking together. I'm glad that there was someone you could lean on while I was away. You've been under a lot of pressure lately. Hey. It felt like every night at the hospital I was seeing your face on the news. People trying to dissect your every word, question who you are, your past, your future. I wanted to say how proud I am that despite having all those people look at you under a microscope, you remain so composed. I know I wouldn't handle it that well. So, how did you do that? I had help. Ah. Uh. Oh, that little thing? It served as a reminder of who I am, who I have always been. A great police officer? Among other things. I just want you to know that if you ever need to talk... I know, Lewis. Thank you. So, what's next for us, partner? Our morning shift is about to start. I'll get my gear. You've got to see this! Moments ago, what was reported as an unidentified creature has entered the OCB headquarters and is creating havoc. Reports of numerous casualties are coming in. No one seems to know what caused the chaos. And most importantly, who is going to stop it? I guess the shift's starting early. Ready, partner? I was born ready. Nah. The job is never ending, basically. <laughs> but yeah. Kind of, kind of hero game. Hero, hero story. Okay, seems like it's OCP has been better. What the hell? It's like a hurricane came through. Stay alert. Creature. Another shift from the ashes. Investigate the area. Feel, feels like At game isn't over. Huh, no such luck. That's a TV helicopter. Uh. They're here already. We have wounded. What happened here? It, it was furious. It destroyed everything in its path. What did? A monster. Robo, I'm in the Channel 9 helicopter. I'm seeing a lot of movement on the executive floor. I know exactly where that is. We need to get up there. No, get the injured out of the building. I will handle what is up there. Sure. Positive. But the buttons bucked out a bit. Murphy, we're finding more and more wounded, and they're all giving me consistent descriptions. So unless everyone is getting it wrong, there's an old friend waiting for you upstairs. You can expect trouble. That's right. Make sure there is no one left in the building. Will do, partner. to the western corner of the executive floor. It, it's something. I... Massacre. 
Are you getting this? All of it. That's the OCP board you're seeing. They were supposed to vote on the new CEO. I guess someone didn't like the candidate they chose. OCP is finished after this. Maybe. Area of investigation. Okay, what did this? Okay. Be careful. Uh, uh, what do you want from me? Oh no. Robocop, my number one guy. There seems to be a misunderstanding. Okay. I wanted to leave you a message before I undergo this procedure. It has been a long and laborious process, but it has given me the opportunity to observe you closely. The old, old man? That you? I, I didn't know. I, I, I didn't mean to. Nope. Selfless and devoted to something bigger than myself. Uncorruptible. And that is what I always strive to be. Rockmurphy. I cannot wait to see what the future has in store for us. You sold the city's future. That leaves one question. <laughs> Scrapyard or prison creep. Uh -huh. Oh no. Murphy, what the hell was that? Just an old friend. Thanks for following, Kalamador.
Ouch. What happened? Okay, what happened? You will not win this. He has iPad on his face. Okay, down we go. Ouch. Down to the cellar. my skills a bit. Oh no. Oh no. Ouch. 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 Next phase, iPad isn't happy. Where is he going? Back to the surface. Going somewhere. Okay, third phase. Get that a missile light on. Building is coming down. Murphy, you need to get out of there. It's about to collapse. The building's evacuated. There's no one else inside. You need to save yourself. Let's leave him to die. Happy uh, eternity. Wait, 
I see something. Is that him? Talk to me. It is me, Lewis. It has always been me. Another week passed since the OCP's magnificent giant has fallen. OCP's new CEO assured us that the destruction of its headquarters will not stand in the way of finishing Delta City. Japanese corporation Kanemitsu has already shown interest in OCP's most ah. project. We at Media Break welcome them with open arms. Delta City, Yokoso. From the City of Wonders, we're back to Detroit. The city's debt has reached a new peak. Re-elected Mayor Kuzak, asked about his plans for reform, said he had other plans instead. OCP is the weakest it's ever been. We'll sue them even if we need a Japanese lawyer, he assures us. Now it's time to introduce a new segment, You the Detroiters, where we share feel-good stories from our local communities. An escaped python terrorizing the local neighborhood has been reunited with its owners. But that wasn't the only thing that was returned. X-ray of the reptile's insides has shown the stolen watches together with the remains of the thief himself. Oh no. Pickles, a local addict, was so intoxicated with nuke that the drug was absorbed by the python, which explains its bizarre behavior. Isn't that food for thought? Next up. Well, that was sadly set sad. Nearly torn to pieces by an ED 209 after not adhering to the 209's instructions. The dispute over a parking space could have turned deadly if it wasn't for Dr. Olivia Blanche, a seasoned psychologist who managed to keep a cool head during the 209's. Pretty nice. Dr. Blanche's new book, Coping with Loss, is said to be of value to both people and machines alike. A defamed reporter funded by terrorists. After trying to illegally broadcast a hit piece aimed at OCP, Samantha Ortiz has been spotted collaborating with a terrorist group led by a woman known in the underworld as Bertha. OCP denies... We're sorry for the disturbance. Fortunately, this time it was a minor one. Let's move on. Hmm. World record has been set Sus. in Detroit. A man called Funeral Bob attended his thousandth funeral this year. <laughs> the record-breaking funeral belonged to Max Becker, a former OCP executive. As it turned out, Bob was its only attendee. <laughs> the OCP delegation yeah, did that not can happen due to a rescheduled business meeting. We hope the meeting went well. Moving on, the owner of a local restaurant, Onion Baji in cahoots with a ring of zoo thieves. The restaurant was proved to source the ingredients through crime. The arrest was made by a rookie neighborhood cop, Ulysses Washington, and according to his statement, it wasn't the first animal he had saved. One question still remains unanswered. What happens to Robocop's human status? Mayor Kuzak distances himself from Robocop and leaves no doubt that he will not be advocating for granting him human rights. Robocop's efforts have prompted a public conversation. I hope OCP doesn't take him off the street. Who will protect us then? Ah, it's Robocop! Robo, I love you! speaker. <laughs> Yeah, he's he's wow. totally totally out. To many more years on the force, Robocop. It's been a busy time for Detroit, but the cloud that lowers over the city is lifting as police end their strike. We're ready to serve, said Officer Ann Lewis, who returned to duty despite her recent injury. What heroism. Detroit can sleep soundly tonight. The question is, for how long? That's all for today. This was Casey Wong. Until next time. Okay.
So, a uh, few ideas, uh, thoughts about the game. Uh, I like this. This was blast from my childhood, and also pretty nice sh role playing slash shooter. Of course, there were like bo some boring fights, like the first Ed 209 fight, which was which was like crazy. But I like the free roaming parts, and that you could uh, actually do different different things and had like side side quests. In the end, this was role-playing game where you take the role of Robop Rob Rob Cup, and at that kind of went pretty really well. You could say that this game didn't have as huge budget, but it was good enough. It has some memory leak issues, even even today, but I think it didn't take much from this game. Uh, th this was good. This was good. Is this AA title? Yeah, sure. You can you can call this as a, as a AA title, and uh, wasn't just the nostal nostalgia money crap like some other Robocop games have have been. So it it was Robocop movie made for fans by fans, where the story was. Mostly adult. I don't think Robocop ever was totally adult. It, it had like gruesome violence, but it wasn't adult in the story that it was like fantasy, police fantasy <laughs> game or well, movie before before that. So yeah, uh, it, it had that 80s feeling, which is maybe the mo biggest biggest uh, contribution I actually took took and uh, watched the first first Robocop movie before this and second movie and yeah it, it was really well made and homage to the to the movie movies so yes definitely good 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 game I recommend this not terribly long you can squeeze out maybe 20 to 30 hours from this only. I I think I made the I played the most most content there was, not not all of them, but yeah, good good game. And now I'm signing off. Uh, thanks for watching. This will come to the YouTube as a uh, supercut of the of the game, and we'll will continue other games later this week. I think. Saturday, I'll show you uh, a bit of other games, and there's several games that I really need to finish. Like Baldur's Gate 3, that's that's a long game, anyway. But I'll I'll show these shooter type of games as well because people like to watch them for some odd reason. Anyway, thanks for watching. Have a nice time. If you want to leave a message, please use um. Use either uh, email, uh, business email, uh, or maybe the YouTube page, uh, common possibility. That, that those are ideas. Anyway, <laughs> all right. It's it's getting late. I'm pretty tired. So without without any more flapping the gums. Good night. Have a nice day, everyone.